I need a one dance, got a Hennessy in my hand. One more time before I go, out of power bodies, I want on me. Yo, bro, stop dodging me. You see what I'm doing? Like, I, I'm recording while I practice. Oh, so you're serious, huh? Oh, shit. Camera's off. Oh, so now you're trying to play. <laughs> What? So you know, let's go. So you're ready? I'm ready. About to get this L, early L, all right? I don't know about the L. I only <laughs> give shit those. Oh shit, okay, okay. Say no more. Let me turn this off. Hey, y'all, I can't lie. I just lost. He won. So that's back to back. Yo, I have been taking too many. <laughs> I've been taking too many L's. Like, this is unacceptable. I need something easy. So I can get a quick W, get back on my feet. Yo, dude, I don't like the W that you took. And all of yesterday, you took a W too in basketball. Oh my gosh, it's gone in basketball, bro. Yo, we lost like seven games. I'm just gonna go jump off this, this <laughs> window right here, bro. Go ahead, please do. All right. Hey, y'all, we're just having the most crazy back to back to back games of table tennis. But I can't lie, he's been beating me with like four in a row. There's like four in a row. But yo, the games are much tighter than they were. The yeah, first time like, we bro, like, yo. We had some crazy smashbacks and like rallies and stuff like that. That was crazy. Hey, y'all, we have literally been playing ping pong for what? Three hours yeah. straight. Like, yo, this is crazy. But yo, at first, you were killing me. Mm -hmm. But I've grown so much in the last few games. I like, bro, it was like four and like one. Put in that work, y'all. Ping pong is a new way. Trust me. All right, y'all. What's good? It's your boy Nick Wavy. I'm back with a new video, and I was gonna go to the gym today. I was gonna go to the YMCA, but I got tired. Like, yo, I was playing ping pong. I was so tired. I played for like three hours. I got lazy. So, I live in a condo. If you guys don't know, so I went to my condo gym for the first time, and condo gyms are not serious. You know, you can't really do much in there. But I was hitting. The most weight that they have there is 50 pounds. So I was hit, oh my gosh, look at how skinny I am. Bro, y'all see, look at my legs. They're the same size as my arms. That's unacceptable for a man that never does legs. That's unacceptable. But on my shoulder there, I started out with these um, military presses, uh, 50 pounds with the seat high. I don't like it high, I like the half cut. That's like to your middle back. That's how I like, it gives me more range of motion. So I hit these 50s again. Oh my gosh, look at my arms, yo. Teeny weeny. Yo, I look like freaking chicken wings, bro. With no meat on them. Chicken wings with no meat on them. But also, ever since I started working out, I've been starting to shave my armpits. Not shave, but trim them. When I trim my hair, I just go and I trim my armpits. It's just, it's just, I can never let it grow out again. It just looks disgusting to me, growing out hair. And then um, after that, I started doing some of my side lateral raises. I believe that's what they're called. Some 15s. I was hella weak this day. I was actually tired too. I don't know. I usually do 20s on that. I don't even do that exercise to be honest. But yeah, all I'm doing with these workout videos is trying to motivate y'all to go to the gym because the gym changed my life. Um, I used to have nightmares of getting beat up. Like I would, like, I would just be punching somebody in the face in my nightmare. And the person would just be like, ha ha ha. They'd be laughing at me like, yo, this is so weak. And then when I started lifting weights, I remember I had a dream where I was punching a man in the face and then he was like, oh yeah, that's soft, it doesn't hurt. And I said to myself in my dream, my subconscious, I was like, wait a minute, Nick, you're in the gym now, beat his ass. So I started, I'm like, yo, hold that, hold that, catch that fade, catch that fade, you know what I mean? And he caught that fade in my dream. Ever since then, I don't have those jeans no more. This right here is my favorite workout, top three favorite workouts of all time. This is how I got my traps real nice and strong. And it looks like I'm about to fly away. I'm just flying. Um, I grab like 20s and I just fly. I focus on my traps and I focus on my upper delts. Mostly on my traps. I've been doing this workout for years and I've seen crazy results while doing it. It's my favorite exercise of all time. Then I shifted over here to the tricep push down. And some man in the gym, right? Shout out to that guy. I forgot his name. But when I was in Barbados, he taught me how to work out and stuff with certain exercises. And he said, triceps, you want to keep, when you're doing tricep push downs, you want to keep your elbows tucked in. And you don't want to go all the way down. 
and you don't want to go all the way up. So as you can see here, I'm kind of locking it, which I shouldn't really be doing, but I was coming halfway up. He said that's going to help um, reduce the chance of getting a blown out elbow from doing your tricep exercises. So as you can see here, my elbows are tucked. At first I used to flare them out and I used to do like a lot of weight. All he did was tuck my elbows in and I had to drop the weight by like 30 pounds. But triceps are one of my strongest on the body part. Uh, yeah, so that worked. That worked. Then uh, over here, also another guy in the gym in Barbados, he taught me. He looked at my body and he's like, yo, you need to work on your outer biceps. So you want to get the bar, you know the wavy bar? I don't know what it's called. We're going to grab it on the inside so you're like this and then pull in and that really works on your upper outer biceps. So I was doing that in Barbados for like two weeks and I seen crazy gains. So that's what I'm doing now. And also, you want to let it go all the way down. I think I was going kind of like halfway. Do I do one more set? Oh, look at that boy. He's flexing now. Okay, okay, okay. I see it. I see it. Oh my gosh. It looks so small though. That's crazy. I'm actually thinking about bulking again, y'all. If y'all think I should start bulking again, post that in the comment section. I'm thinking about it because you guys are seeing me now work out. You guys never seen me work out before and I'm small. And that's not good. But you can see my body it looks nice though. And I, I was doing the bicep like, okay, wait a minute. Let it go all the way down. Cause that's what the guy told me. So let it go all the way down and it's activating your most lower part of your bicep. That's how you get a full arm. And I was just hitting it. I'm not grabbing the bar. I'm really holding it kind of light. I'm barely even holding it. Like I think there's a point where I just start lifting it like this. I just let my muscles do the, the work. I don't strength train. I body build, so I build my body. That's what I do. So a lot of people be benching two plates, three plates, four plates. I don't do that. I just body build. I might be a bodybuilder. I don't even know. I'm just playing. I ain't gonna do that. But oh yeah, yeah, look at that boy. Okay, now you're talking. Now you're talking. You can see those stretch marks because I got gains super fast. I made super fast gains when I started. Okay, there you go. Activate that muscle, boy. Flex on the haters, man. Flex on the haters, man. There you go. There you go. All right, y'all. Let's get back to the vlog. Hey, y'all. So I just had a nice workout. But something I want to address right now is people be like, yo, Nick, how'd you get big so fast? Yo, Nick, how do you do this so fast, that so fast? But what y'all don't see is what goes on behind the scenes. Y'all just see the finished product. So nobody seen my body for like nine months. And I came out and dropped the pick. And y'all were like, yo, guys on steroids. How do you get so big? What are you doing? Blah, 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 blah. It happens so fast. Nah, nothing ever happens fast. You have to put in work. Like, I'm sick. I can't even talk properly. I just had an hour and 30 minute workout. You know what I mean? In the condo gym. You know, condo gyms aren't even blessed. So it's just called putting in work, y'all, no matter what. Don't take days off. That's how you be successful. So my boy gave me a code for Uber Eats. I'm gonna get some curry right now. So, butter chicken. Up, yep. mm -hmm. So I said, if the man brings me my food to my front door, I'll give him a tip. If he makes me go downstairs to get my food, I ain't gonna give him a tip. So he came up, I gave him a $2 tip. Let me show you guys what I got. Yo, it smells super nice. So we got some man bread, freshly made, and Some butter chicken. All right, hold up. Oh, that's spilling all over. It smells great. But where the chicken at, though? Hey, y'all, uh, yesterday, right? Jude was playing the Chris Brown Phantom of Fat. I'm listening to it now. Kind of want to bake right now. Like, sometimes at night, like, when I'm not saying anything, right? It gets real quiet in here sometimes, like, it gets real quiet. Might need to get a bass soon, y'all. I can't talk to a girl, I can't like, hey, what's up, girl, my name is Nick. Listen to my voice. So I'm gonna be bayless. <laughs> my voice is fully gone, like, I can't talk. So, like, I might have to take a little break. I'm gonna need everybody to post the prey emojis because I have fully lost my voice, I can't talk. I forgot what it was like to talk normally. So everybody hit the like button. 
Everybody post the pray emojis in the comment section. So I feel better soon. Um, I don't know. Hopefully I feel better tomorrow because I want to vlog and do videos and stuff. But hopefully I feel better soon. I'm going to catch y'all in the next video.